Hello guys and gals and welcome back to Lumberjack Dynasty. Today we're working on the daily quest called Find My Missing Sheep. Daily quest was a white expo exclamation points. Um, the orange ones are your regular quests that you can that you need to do. But we are going to do Find My Missing Sheep. So I'm gonna highlight this one. And we're gonna work on that and I'm gonna show you how to do that. So I'll meet you at that at the hotel and be right back. Okay guys and gals, we're at the place. Uh, I think oh, we're at the place. Let's double check the map. Yeah, we're at the location. What we need to do is hold the right mouse button down. Now at the Those hotel there's groups on. of people in different locations. So you got some over here. You got some behind the hotel. And then you got... Right, let's just go the other way. Yeah. And then you got... groups on the other side of the front of the hotel. So we go to where the exclamation point is. It's hard to be sure. And we'll go and talk to... Charles. I am not surprised. Hello. Hi there. We'll hit number one. Need any help? Need me to help you with something? Can you help me find my sheep? I'm afraid she's lost. Sure. No problem. Okay. We accept the quest. We hold the right mouse button down and you'll see like little echoes all over the place. So let's go this way. Holding the right mouse button down as you run. Actually, we need to be on the other side of the mountain so we can you sprint a little bit faster when you are not holding the right mouse button down. Um, tell you what, let's go to that one. Can't jump these fences, so... There it is. And if you're going uphill, I find... As you're doing the East Quest, and the other reason why you want to hold the right mouse up up and down, because the other benefit is actually you find mushrooms. So we pick up the mushrooms as we go along, because mushrooms we can use to eat, use in cooking, and we don't have to buy mushrooms. And once you've unlocked the where you can collect herbs. Herbs are also with the mushrooms. So you can find herbs. I thought it was also no, nope, that's the same thing before. So that's the other benefit of doing find my missing sheep to find mushrooms. Now mushrooms do grow back. <coughs> and they usually where animals is. This is the the echoes are the sounds of the animal. This is a stork that we found but we'll collect these mushrooms that, while we're here you got different types of animals you got hogs you got wild boar that's what it is wild boar deer and birds um mainly cranes as aunt grace would say the thieving birds because they steal your apples and you need to get Certain things set up, and we'll talk about that later. Oh, got some over here. Oh yeah, you also find strawberries. I like collecting mushrooms because if I don't, that's once I get to a certain point, I don't have to buy mushrooms anymore. Because we do use a lot of mushrooms in our cooking. There's one. And when you collect the mushrooms, you kind of get turned around. Oh, there's some more. And scan the area pretty well, because we did, we talked about this in the early episode, but this is the benefit of finding my missing, doing find my missing sheep, is um, you find a lot of things. And as you do the storyline, there's more mushrooms. 
That's an herb, but we haven't unlocked herbs collection yet. And sheep <coughs> can be far away from where so typical. From where you at too. Sheep actually travel pretty far distances. Yeah, this one's gonna be down here. Uh, that was wild boar. Once the animal flies away, the echo actually stops. So. And I try to collect as much mushrooms as I can. So what I'll do is I'll just go, you know how to collect mushrooms by now. And when I find the missing sheep, I'll bring you back. Okay, guys and gals, we found the sheep. Now you can pick up the sheep and still collect the mushrooms. Basically where animals are is basically where you, where you will find mushrooms. And we are almost on the... Let me pick up these mushrooms here. Excuse me. By picking up the mushrooms, you, you, you save money. Um, we are 674 meters away since we have to go through the, from where the sheep owner is, so we have to go a fair distance. And since we're going to be going back through the woods, and unfortunately you can't pick up just any sheep. It has to be the mission sheep. So you can't just pick up one of these and take it back. Now it has to be the sheep. It has to be their sheep. Unfortunately, that's the way it works. But on the way back, we can pick up some mushrooms. Which makes it all, which actually makes it worthwhile. Now, if you stop and collect every mushroom like I do, it takes a little bit longer. And sometimes you can go to the first echo and you find your sheep. And sometimes it's like forever, like I just did. Of course, when I'm filming, find my missing sheep. It's the last echo. <laughs> so it, the sheep are randomly placed in the um thing and i am going i tell you what that's it no more mushrooms no more mushrooms uh and i'll do a how to hunt for mushrooms video so if you don't want to do farm my missing sheep and you want need mushrooms you can hunt for them so I find if you skip going up, you actually go uphill a little bit quicker. You wouldn't do and we go to surprised. Charles here. You've saved my sheep. Thank you very much. And if you look in the upper left hand corner, it takes okay, we got melon seeds. We don't need melon seeds, but we got fifteen melon seeds. Plus we got fifty dollars and five hundred points. So we actually did pretty good. Um, let's go to the food. I haven't bought any. I bought some mushrooms, but right now we got a total of 110. But we do have four mushrooms, so that's four strawberry or honey pancakes that we can make. You use that. So that's how you do find my missing sheep if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button and bell that way you know when the latest videos i do come along and when i go live here on youtube also do me a favor hit that like button every like i get gets this channel seen a little bit more which helps grow this channel and i would really appreciate that and as always have fun playing your games be safe out there in the world and i'll see you in the next one bye bye